Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Hope you're all having an awesome day. Today is Wednesday, June 24th, I believe. And we are headed to go and pick up our tile for our backsplash because that's going to be installed this weekend. I'm so excited. And what is the other thing we're doing? Picking up our stain for our oh, staircase. Yes, we are going to the place that we're getting our staircase done and our floors done. And they're, they've prepared like three samples of stain for our stairs to match the floors, like a lighter, medium and darker version so that we can pick what which one we like the best. And yeah, I'm sure George is super happy with all this fun stuff, fun child stuff we're doing, right Georgie? Yeah, you're so happy to go pick up tile and pick out stain. Oh yeah! Look at the trees! You, you see? <laughs> you can see some trees? What else do you see? I see the road! You see the road? What else do you see? The car is in the road. The car is in the road? And what else? Yes, the road might mean stop. Yes, it does. And the road might mean go. Yes, it does! You're, you're a better driver than Dad! <laughs> Look at my disheveled quarantine man. <laughs> Need a haircut. Look at the horse, Georgie. Did you see it? Did you really? Probably not. Oh, because you didn't look in time. You gotta look. Some there's lots of cows and horses and chickens. Everything around here. You know what? I actually haven't seen a chicken. <laughs> just, up here, not once. I'm sure there are, but, but I've seen but a they're lot of in horses the, and cows. Because they don't let the chickens just come up there. They're in a chicken coop. I know this will sound weird. I think I told you this, but I saw a black and white cow, like a spotted cow, like you see in cartoons. I've never seen in my life a spotted cow. I've always seen like these furry you, cows. You mean a dairy cow? Is that what they're called? Uh, the black know. and white ones. I just always assumed that all cows can be dairy cows. I see cows that are brown with hair, and I see cows that are black with hair, but I've never seen, seen excuse me, a spotted cow. I think black and white spots. I think the black and white cows are dairy cows, and they're kept. What did you do? You you dropped your toy. Yeah, he okay. put it by the door. He we're can't gonna reach it. We're gonna oh. get it when we stop. Okay. Cause mom, look at look at mom's seatbelt. I can't come out just like your seatbelt. We're stuck. Eh, eh, I can't. Okay. Yeah. Let me know if you're, um, you know, familiar with cow stuff. <laughs> but I think the white and black ones, you don't see them just hanging out because they're usually. Comment below, guys. Have you ever seen a spotted white and black cow? I feel like it's nowadays weird. they're just like in friggin' factories attached by the. No. I've never ever being seen. Being sucked dry. No. Even, I'm telling you, even dairy cows. Because you haven't gone. I've seen black and brown cows. What I've are never you talking about? No, those are dairy cows. cows. And then the ones you see grazing, they're. They're. What? Your steak they're dinner? meat cows. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> they're my meat cows. <laughs> okay. Oh, comments are gonna be flooding. Okay, so I hope to take you in with me while well, you're my phone. I'm on my phone, so I'm gonna take you in with me. But I hope to um, film a little bit because I love videos of people who are doing renos and they like take me along and all the little steps and all the little processes. But um, we haven't been doing that because it's been quarantined, so it's been very limited. A lot of stuff's been done over the phone, um, or they'll send like one person in with a mask, and it's just like a quick um, like meeting and stuff like that. We haven't really done the traditional going into tons of stores and shopping around, stuff like that. So yeah, I hope to take you guys in with me, and we'll see what the rest of the night takes us. I get so excited because we usually go out like once a week on a little drive, whether it's to pick up some groceries. It's been more like once a month. 
<laughs> it's usually all going through the uh, groceries, right? Because obviously, because of quarantine. No, no, I know. But lately, but like, lately, yeah. it's been like once a month where Jim will just be like, "Want to go for a drive? Let's hop in the car. Let's go get Tim Hortons or whatever the case." Or like, "Oh, we need dog food. Let's all go in the car." Like something that back in the day, like pre-Corona. I'd just be like, we need dog food, get it on your way home. Like, we wouldn't want to leave the house for something so little like that. Because we'd be leaving the house so much more regularly. Uh, now it's like, we need dog food? Woohoo! Family vacation! And we hop in the car and we all go and stuff like that. Do you like your little car rides, George? Yeah. He's so excited to like walk. Oh, I need to hold your hand too. Oh, you want to do horsey with dad? she's getting because our staircase is oak a lot of the redness or orangeness shows through so it looks kind of different from the floor like it has a lot of that yellow so we're thinking to go darker would kind of hide that redness a bit this kind of looks close way better than these these choices of stain these ones are too much yellow and orange and whatever coming through this one's probably the best going going a shade darker than our floors like this is one shade darker than the floors so that it can hide some of that um, orangey yellow and this would be like the risers and the posts basically painted white so I think it works. I just asked her to go pull up and like if she has a sample of something one shade or two shades darker than this to see if it really hides the orange, but I'm thinking this is okay. So the very bright natural light that like like the light that is installed okay. is very bright and natural. So um, if you want, you can come to the back sure. and have a look there. Okay. okay. It will make it will make it will make it very different. Okay. Your destination is on the right. <laughs> oh, I'm supposed to call, right? Yeah. Your hands. Ow. <laughs> Say it to him, and then. But then you... I lose a finger. <laughs> That's so funny. It's What's... really not though, because it hurts. What's Dad doing? Yeah, because we're going to get the tile now. Yep. 45 square feet or nine boxes of soul my diamond. Or diamond? Yep. Pardon? Oh. Mini pencils are two. It's got the stain enhancer, which is there. Good stuff. Or the stain proof. Yep. 3,000 white. Okay. Two bags. 
The one on the bottom is the mortar? Yeah, these two are mortar. Okay. This one's grout. Oh, solid. Right. You don't have to seal the grout, but the sealer you're going to be putting on anyways. Okay. Yeah. Seal the stone before you grab it. Yeah, I, I got a guy that's going to come and do it. So okay. I'm, Make sure. I'm hoping for those. You can seal those before you install them. Okay. This would be certain that he does grout first in this. Okay. Because I've had people call me and say, we've grouted for some reason. It changed we color. We clean the tile. And I'm like, did you seal before you grout it? Yeah. Like, no. I'm assuming that is that container enough for the Oh thing? yeah, that, that container will do up to 107 square feet. Okay, solid. So you're not dousing it, you're okay. just um, you can put a spray cap on that bottle, spray it on, like mist it on. Okay. And then wipe off the excess after it's had a minute to absorb. Okay. Um, if the excess is sticky, yeah. put them on a lint free cloth and wipe it off, it'll reactivate and you'll be able to wipe it off. Awesome. Are you riding your bike? Yeah. You're a little bit too short. Push, push. It's not working. Push like this, come on. And around and around your feet go. Come on. Push you have to pedal. One. Push this one. I think at three, he'll be more. Go straight. So, Jim got a shed. What is it? Do they have it in feet? No, they do not. Yes, it's a ten by. They don't have it in feet. Well, it says it in inch in inches. But it's this color. Yeah. So yeah. Yeah, it's a wood type texture. So it's 117, so 120, so that'd be about 10 feet by eight feet. Ten by eight. Okay, come, George. Don't just let him go. Hold his shirt at least. Steer, steer straight, buddy. No, no, straight. Straight's like this. Okay. <laughs> You're just, hey, listen, kid, <laughs> try to move your feet a little bit. We're not just going to... All right, Joe. Good. As busy as you can be. Look at him being all neighborly. <laughs> Let's unload the... I only know two neighbors. Kevin and Joel. No, there's a, the we know the neighbors on this side too. Okay, but we've talked to them a lot. I'm very far back. What evil things are you thinking about doing? You are in the rain. You're not strong enough? I think you are. Try a different angle. Instead of pushing, pull it. Yeah. And come over here and back up, back up. And you'll be able to move it how you want. There you go. <laughs> You're very strong. Holy smokes, you're cleaning so nicely. No. All of a sudden it's like so sunny. It's been, thank you. Are you cleaning like me? Yeah. Okay, can daddy have that for a little bit so I can finish sweeping? Yeah. Awesome, thanks buddy.
What are you having, George? A popsicle. Yeah, it's a freezy, it's an organic juice pop or whatever. So it's just like natural fruit juice instead of just like that artificial, like the freezies we grew up with. They're pretty, they're pretty tasty. Can I see, can I see the picture to see what fruit is in it? It's a pineapple orange. And it's uh, organic. Okay, so you want to see. I'm so excited about this backsplash. You just have to like open every single box and make sure that none of them are broken. See, like this one has so much color on it compared to some pieces won't have a ton. But like, look how beautiful. There's the gray, there's like the taupe. We have some cream diamonds, some pure white diamonds, but still subtle enough to not really clash. I think it matches perfectly. And you know, some people say like, oh, are you sure you want your kitchen all white? Isn't it gonna be too bland? But look with the, with the veining here, and the marble color in here to have a pure white cabinet. I think there's enough going on. But if you look at this sample she gave me, it's like pure white, barely any of the gray or taupe. So every piece, every sheet is gonna be different. So I think it'll look really, really nice and it won't, it won't be too much or too little. Let's see what even just the second sheet looks like in this pack. This one's pretty, this pack is pretty dark, pretty color, colorful. I guess every batch will be different. Okay, let me look at this one. This one's a lot less colorful compared, right? We've got more color in this one than in this one. And then I'm sure there's gonna be ones that are pure white like this. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited, they're so beautiful. Wow. And against our counters, love, love, love. Pineapple juice. Yeah. Pineapple juice. Pineapple juice. <laughs> Nana bought those for you. You want to say anything to her? Uh -huh. What do you want to say to her for buying you those? Um, this pineapple juice. Do you want to say thanks or anything? Thanks. I hope you guys enjoyed today's vlog. If you did, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you're not already. I also hope you're loving the reno and decor vlogs. There's definitely more to come. So we'll see you in the next video. Bye, guys. Say goodbye. Goodbye, guys. <laughs>